Today, let's talk about secret of giving. How many of you believe in the power of giving that when you give unconditionally and when you try to help someone, you receive? Today, I'm going to share a very nice and a very short incident with you all. Well, it's a story of a girl who was going to college. One day, she went to her college and she saw a group of people sitting there talking about how important it is to donate the blood and how you can save someone's life. So she was sitting at the back listening to the whole talk where they were reinforcing the idea of donating blood because they belonged to an organization who were there to facilitate people and children who are suffering from thalassemia. After the whole conversation, they asked who was going to donate the blood. And she was so happy. She said, I will be the first one to do it. She gave one bottle of blood. They said, thank you. And they also mentioned that when they will use the blood, she will be informed. After some time, she receives this card which says, thank you. Today, your one bottle of blood saved someone's life. She felt so happy and so fulfilled because she knew that God has chosen her out of so many to save someone's life. Years passed by. Four years later, she was in a car accident and she ended up in a hospital where the only thing she could hear was, we need one bottle of blood to save her life. We need one bottle of blood or she will die. And now she is lying on her bed, taking her last breaths because there was a lot of internal bleeding and she needed blood. Out of nowhere, someone came in the room and said, this is my blood group and I will give one bottle of blood. I will save her life. When he said that, in a flashback, she could read that card again, which said, thank you. Today, your one bottle of blood has saved someone's life. And that's how that one bottle of blood saved her life after four years. The name of that girl was Munima Mazari. That was the moment where I realized that if you try to help someone unconditionally without expecting anything in return, God has his way of paying back and God never forgets.